from Chilliwack, please put your hands together for Keller Wheat Reeves. Hammer, thank you very much. I'm actually originally from Wally. <laughs> but by now I live in Chilliwack. I can afford a house there, that's why I moved there actually. <laughs> but Chilliwack's a funny place because you um, you can't ride a bicycle down the street without someone saying, hey, did you steal that? <laughs> it's one of those kind of places, right? I'm very excited. It's my first time here since they changed the name to Keto, uh, keto Cafe and everything, right? Uh, because I've been doing uh, Keto since July. <laughs> and I was all pumped to come down here, right? And I was like, ah. I'm gonna eat everything. I, like, I showed up like two hours early just to eat things. So I was like, I want that, the chocolate cheesecake. I would like, yes, I would like a pizza. Personal size, no, I'll have the full size. No big deal. And just, I ate fucking everything. I have a cookie for the ride home. I'm so excited. <laughs> I've lost 50 pounds on keto, believe it or not. Just wow. July, yeah. Yeah, it's like two full bra sizes. It's unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> they only shrunk on me, right? <laughs> but no, it's, uh, I tried a couple diets before that. Um, uh, the first one, they, they never work, right? But the first one was like uh, the polygamy diet where every day was a cheat day. Didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> the reverse turkey diet, you heard of that one? It's where you get baked all day and stuff yourself full of bread. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Work it all. <laughs> Dementia diet, that's where you forget you ate and just keep eating. <laughs> that one worked the worst, actually. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the best diet I've actually ever been on is uh, bulimia. To be, huh? yeah. <laughs> it's the easiest. <laughs> It's also really good for the abs, unbelievable. It's all that heaving, it's like just, it's like doing a thousand crunches in one, you know. I used to wrestle, anybody wrestle here? Back in the day? Oh, sorry kid, of course you wrestle. Yeah, yeah anybody that's uh, wrestled knows that uh, if you don't throw up your lunch, even trying to make weight, bro, I mean, that's the thing. It's just one of those things, right? But no, like 50 pounds, that's a lot of weight. Like any 100 pounders here? Anybody weigh 100 pounds? It's gotta be, it's Vancouver. Someone's gotta weigh around 100 pounds. So come on. Right? I've lost half of that person. That's pretty much this. You just cut that person in half and just, you know, just saw them in half. Get rid of the top half. Just keep the fun part. Just get rid of the top part. Right? You know, that part, right? That uh, wants you to listen and hold hands in public. Get rid of that part. I don't want it. Get rid of that part. Right? But you know, still after losing 50 pounds, I'm still three times heavier than a 100 pound person right now. Still. Yeah. Six times heavier than that person that wants me to go to their Christmas party. They forget it. <laughs> top half is. Okay, I'm just trying to tell you that the top half's no fun. The bottom, the bottom half, anytime you get an argument, we'll just walk away. The top half wants the last word in edgewise every time. <laughs> okay, that's just the wrong way to go here. <laughs> Believe me. Let's see. <laughs> uh, do you guys like impressions? Yeah. 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 You, are you excited in this for impressions? Yeah. You're the only person I can see, actually. So <laughs> I can't see anybody past here. My glasses are glaring <laughs> off. So it's like because I'm blind up here. Yeah. Here's a impression of me coming home drunk and trying to pet my cat. Okay? <laughs> Who's a pretty kitty? Who's a pretty kitty? <laughs> That's pretty much it. <laughs> yes, I'm a grown man that still says pretty kitty. It's my fucking cat in my life. I'll do whatever I fucking want. Don't judge me. I think he really wants to hurt me. That's what he really wants to do. He, he feels happiest when he wants to hurt me. And he has no idea he's just hurting my feelings and not my skin. That's the thing. So, just kind of keep this up. Let um, me see how much time I got. Okay, good. Uh, I got a utilicilt. Anybody got a utilicilt here? You guys know what that is? A utilicilt? Okay, I'm going to tell you what it is, okay? 
it's a t kilt you get from Seattle, okay? It's really thick, like, workers, like, canvas sort of thing. And it's got, like, it's awesome. It's got, like, hammer holders and, like, big pockets for screws and, like, a drill holster. It's fucking great. I love fucking wearing my utility kilt. I'll walk around all the time in my utility kilt all the time. Like, I've been fucking wearing the shit out of this thing. It's too big for me now, but I've been wearing the shit out of it. You know, you know. And, I, you know, my wife and I just, I'm always strutting around town, especially when I come down just fucking cool, think I'm cool, right? And I come down, and uh, my wife and I, we go down to see a comedy show, and uh, she's big on Fluvog. You guys know what Fluvog is, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's a shoe store out here, and she always wants to go in. Look, we got to go in. So, okay, we'll go in, no problem. And I kind of go walking with her and enjoying it. And, you know, we go inside, and I'm like, oh, that's pretty cool. And the, and the guy on the counter goes, hey, you know, nice utility kilt. <laughs> Thank you. I was like, oh, you recognize the brand. That's unbelievable. Thank you. He's like, yeah, my ex-boyfriend had like four of them. I just stole one. I was like, oh. I was like, man, that's unbelievable. Um, can I ask you a question? He's like, yeah. You're the second person to identify this kilt, and both guys have been gay. Can I ask you why? He's like, oh, yeah, it's a fetish thing. <laughs> a fetish thing? What do you what do you mean a fetish thing? He goes, Oh yeah, bears like to wear. Like, oh, so big bearded guys like to wear utilicals around? He goes, Oh yeah, it's all the rage. <laughs> I was like, oh, well, thing. Okay, yeah. And all of a sudden everything started darting through my mind of all the things I've been wearing it around and the comments and the fucking it's it's like weird stuff all the time, right? But the, the I'll tell you the last one because I don't got a lot of time, but the uh I went to a big birthday party with a bunch of comedians uh, down on Davie Street wearing my kilt. It didn't really matter. I didn't care. But I went up to the bar and we're hanging out and uh, there was karaoke. It was fucking horrible, but I sat there. But I tell you, man, everybody was so fucking nice to me there. <laughs> Smiling at me, winking at me. One guy offered to show me where the bathroom was. I'm like, I don't need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> okay, my name is Kelly. Thank you guys very much.